now that we are done with it let's just see what are the option under the frame as you can see we've got a frame we've got a section and we've got slice more about these on a different course since this is just for beginners to get you going now let's start from here as you can see here you've got a move option and a scale option when you want to to quickly toggle to the move option you press v when you want to toggle to the uh, scale option you press k this is very important more especially as a beginner if you don't understand this you might struggle to resize things here on figma let me just give you an example let's say you've got a text that you want to scale then you can click here you can type something for now what we can do since this screen it's very small we can just delete these screens and we can create our own canvas or our own frame the one that is going to be bigger and is going to fill the entire screen i'm happy with this now let's say you've got your text here okay let me change the size to be a little bit bigger as you can see this text is a little bit bigger but now let's say i want to scale it okay if you can click here and scale it as you can see it doesn't scale when you want to scale down as you can see it doesn't scale so what can we do in this case remember we said we've got move and also we've got scale so if you want to scale this you must come here and click scale and then from there you can scale it meaning that when you are scaling it the whole text or the whole object is scales proportionally okay so meaning that when you press v it means that you are interested in the detail and customizing the actual element okay so let me show you an example so what i want you to do now as i'm toggling between uh, v and k just look at what is going on here on the on this properties panel now i am on k i'm going to make a shortcut as you can see here it's either we press v on the keyboard or we press k now automatically we are on k for scaling now what i'm going to do i'm going to press v as you can see when we press v we've got more option but when we click again and press k we've got less option so if you want to know if you are on v or you are on k k for scaling and v for moving you you can check based on the sizes or based on the this display of the properties panel if you've got a lot of things here you must know that you are already on the move option if you've got less options just like this one this means that you are exactly on the k option for scaling i hope you got that one if you might have any questions feel free to check or feel free to comment to shoot a comment in the um, down below now let's continue let me delete this now let's continue now you can see that we've got the move and we've got the scale let's see what are the use of these let's say we want to create a random shape and then if we want to move it around as you can see we are already on the move okay so we can move this and um, scale it and do whatever that you want we can change the width and we can change the height so basically this is for moving objects around the screen and then as we have demonstrated um, before that we've got the scale option when you want to some sort of scale things proportionally this is very important proportion in design it's very important imagine if you can take a picture and then take it to a design program and only increase the width of it it means that it's going to look squashed meaning that you are supposed to scale the picture or the image up instead of increasing the width because once you increase the width only you are tempering the with the proportion of the actual image which is professionals don't do that 
even people who know nothing about design, they can see that there is something wrong with the image. Let's say you are trying to fight with the laws of nature. Okay, so let's continue. Now that you know how to use the, the move tool and also you know how to use the scale tool. We are already um, done with the, the frame tool. Now, let's say you want to create your own custom shapes.